Welcome to the Fawn website, your source of timely and accurate weather-related information. Through our website, you can access current and archived data from all our weather stations, as well as our suite of weather-related tools. This brief tutorial will provide you with an overview of how to access the information you need. On the map of Florida, there is a Fawn weather station located at each number and the number represents the current temperature at each station. The colored background on the map represents areas of warmer and cooler temperatures, with warmer temperatures shown in red and yellow colors, and cooler temperatures in blue and green colors. Rolling your mouse over a temperature on the map will display all the current observations for that station to the left of the map. Selecting a temperature will redirect you to a page that shows additional observations and information about that station. Additional parameters can be viewed by selecting from the list to the left of the map. Wet bulb temp shows the current wet bulb temperature at each station. Wind shows the current wind speed and direction, with speed and colors and arrows showing the direction in which the wind is flowing. Red and yellow colors represent higher speeds, while blue and green colors lower speeds. Daily min temp shows the minimum temperature at each station from the previous day. Daily average temp shows the average temperature at each station from the previous day. Daily ET shows the evapotranspiration amount at each station from the previous day, again with reds and yellows indicating higher amounts and greens and blues lower amounts. Daily total rain shows the total rainfall at each station from the previous day. Weekly total rain shows the total rainfall amount at each station over the previous seven days. And forecast min temp shows the National Weather Service's forecasted minimum temperature for the next 12 hours. The time or period of time for which the observations are valid is displayed under the heading for that parameter. Along the left side of the home page are links to several frequently used pages. The Freeze Alert Tech Service is a subscription-based service Fawn offers during the winter. Subscribers to this service will receive text and or email messages when user-specified conditions occur at a Fawn station. Next is Latest Observations, which shows all the current observations for all stations in a table. Graphic weather data graphs up to seven days of temperature, wind speed, relative humidity, or rainfall from any station. The Fawn Data Hotline allows access to data via a toll-free telephone number. An NWS forecast redirects to the National Weather Service forecast map page, where detailed forecast information can be obtained. Continuing down the left side of the page is a button that links to My Florida Farm Weather, a joint project between Fawn and the Florida Department of Agriculture and Consumer Services, or FDAX in which Fawn is collecting and disseminating the data from grower-owned weather stations cost-shared by FDAX. Selecting this button shows a Google map on which data from these stations as well as others can be displayed. Tweets is the Fawn Twitter feed. In this area we post system updates and announcements. The green menu bar across the top provides access to all Fawn data and tools. Data Access provides access to all archived Fawn data. Tools are the heartbeat of Fawn. When you hover your mouse over Tools, a complete list of all Fawn tools appears organized into categories. You can also click on Tools to open up a separate page that contains a complete list. The cold protection tools provide guidance for using water for cold protection. The irrigation scheduling tools provide irrigation scheduling for a variety of crops as well as landscape. Then Tools contains several uncategorized tools, such as the Air Temperature Threshold tool, which returns the number of hours a fawn site was above or below a user-specified temperature, and the Citrus Pesticide tool, which categorizes conditions for applying chemicals based on National Weather Service forecasts. Climate provides links to climate-related resources from agroclimate.org, the University of Florida's climate program. For example, you can access climate outlooks and forecasts, as well as crop-specific tools. 
About shows some background information about Fawn. As with tools, mousing over this heading shows a list of available options. For example, under Fawn Towers, technical info provides details on all the technology Fawn uses on each of its weather stations, including sensor specifications, communications, etc. Location information shows a table with details on the location of each Fawn station. There are also links to information about the Fawn team and how to join us on Facebook and Twitter. News links to past editions of our newsletter. Donate shows the different ways you can support Fawn financially. About 70% of Fawn's budget is provided by sources outside the University of Florida. Therefore, donations are a significant part of our program. Finally, Sponsor shows all the companies, trade associations, and other organizations that provide $1,000 or more in support each year. Fawn thanks to Southwest Florida Water Management District for funding development of this tool and you for using the Fawn website.